my hair appointment I don't have to leave my house for another like 30 minutes so I'm literally just like sitting here I got some hair from Julia hair and I'm going to be having a wig installed and I had a wig made for me so I'm super excited I'll include a clip right now so you guys can see what the hair look like so I'm just gonna give you guys a quick overview of the hair so we have the frontal and we have three bundles of Brazilian straight in 10 inches as you can see it says 10 inches so the reason why i got the 10 inches if i haven't mentioned it in any other clips is because i want to do a bob and obviously you need short hair for that i don't want to you know get 16 inches 18 inches of hair just to cut it and waste all of it so i got three bundles of 10 inch brazilian straight hair and a frontal and this is going to be turned into a wig that you guys will see soon i'm super excited i told myself i said for my birthday i want to have a bob and i want my i want it to be my natural hair but obviously my hair did not grow quick enough i mean i don't know who i was trying to fool hopefully at the one year mark i can have like my own like natural bob like i won't have to get a wig made which is what i did that's why i got 10 inches of hair so i told myself i want a bob so it's november my birthday is in I don't really know how to count. Um, my birthday's in 15 days. Um, I feel really, really old. Um, I look old. <laughs> I just feel really, really um, old and crusty, so it's time for a new look. I'm gonna be getting this bob done, and you guys are gonna see all of that. So thank you, Julia Hair, for sending over the hair. I appreciate it very much. I have purchased hair from them before, personally, so it's cool that they sent me some hair this time. Thank you so much. I've never had a bad issue, or never had an issue in general with their hair, with shedding, none of that. Like, I've never had a bad problem, and I feel like I always get a good amount of hair. If you guys saw those wefts, I always get a good amount of hair for the price. So, yeah, let's go get this hair did, because these little... Colitas, whatever the whatever this is right here, this is not working. Oh, I am all done. My hair is laid, bitch. Okay, have you guys ever seen that meme of Azalea Banks where she goes, I do, with her glasses? I do. Literally, that was like my inspiration for this hair. But yeah, my wig is installed. Literally, you guys, like I said, it's a wig, so... <laughs> So as you guys can see, um, they did the like cap method, which means like you just, you literally just put on a bald cap and then you, not a bald cap, but like a, a lace cap and then you spray this and then you cut around it. So I'm gonna start doing that, but I need to go and buy some, what's it called? I need to go and buy some stock caps. That's what they're called, stocking caps. I need to go buy some so I can start doing that when I lay my wigs. Yeah, my hair is all done. I thought I would show you guys. I'll talk a little bit more in the morning, so I will be right back. Hey guys, so um, excuse the bleach stain on my hoodie. This is like my favorite jacket, so I'm still gonna wear it. So I'm gonna show you guys how I install the wig and how freaking easy and fast it is. So many of you guys tell me like, Vanessa, make a video where you like show us how you like make your wigs. So whenever I do decide to make a wig, you guys, I will I will walk you through it. Because as of like lately, I have just been dropping off the hair and having them turned into wigs. So I don't have to do it myself. So I'm going to show you guys how I install my wigs. And as you just saw by the clip, it's so easy to put it on and off. First, I take my stocking cap. So I guess this is for people who have never put wigs on before. I'm not going to be doing the spray method because I have been going back and forth with my wigs every single day. Like I wear like a different one every day, so I'm a new bitch every day. <laughs> you will not catch me wearing the same hair more than once in a week. I don't know why. I feel like Wednesday's a mood, Tuesday's a different mood, you know? Honestly, I'd rather it be this way than like in the past, I would like get them like glued down and I would be stuck with that wig for like the next two weeks. And I mean, there's nothing wrong with that but I like to change my look like every single day. <laughs> I have washed it, so now you guys are gonna actually see how thick the hair is and how nice it is because the girl who does my hair always like sprays it with like this sheen spray and puts all these like oils and stuff in it. So now you guys will actually truly be able to see the hair. Oh, and also I forgot to fucking mention that it was dyed black. The hair does not come black. It comes in, I think, 1B or like an off brown, like you know that natural color? 
I don't know why I, did, I failed to mention that, so I'm glad I'm saying it now. The hair was dyed jet black. I don't have any jet black wigs right now, so I wanted to like have something for when I'm feeling that like mysterious look. So as you can see, she installed a band on the inside. I did not know about these like things, like bands, and how important they are until like recently. So I'm so glad I have that. That makes sure that the wig stays on. So I grabbed the front of it. I put the band to the back of my head. Hopefully you guys can see. I put it right where my hairline stops. I don't go too low because I don't want to like mess with my braids too much. And then flip it. There's hooks in there or there's clips in there. So I make sure I pull those all the way down. Pull the wig back. And I look like a pumpkin. So I have my straightener on and I'm going to go ahead and flat iron her because I did not put her on my mannequin head. I have like 10 of these with different wigs on them and this girl ended up just laying flat so we got some creases and stuff. The flat iron I use is just a regular one. You know when you like are walking in the mall and those people won't like fucking leave you alone and you end up somehow like walking away with like a hair straightener that they allegedly said you're getting a discount on when in reality it's not that good. That's this. I got this hair straightener so long ago but it still works so I mean I'm not complaining. Basically, I'm just trying to like flatten it all out because we got some flyaways and we got some some poofiness going on. Yeah, this is like my only like jet black wig. I don't wear it a lot for a reason because honestly, it's it's jet black. And if I'm like pale during the winter, which I usually get, like this camera makes me look super super white, but like I promise you, <laughs> I'm brown. I don't know why, like, but just jet black hair, or maybe it's the camera, I don't know. It just always washes me out so much. So I have to be careful with how I do my makeup that day and everything and my outfit. I was wearing this wig and my mom said I looked evil for some reason. Um, <laughs> do you guys think I look evil with jet black hair? Comment below, thanks. And that's literally all I do. So today I did really, really simple makeup. All I have on is mascara and some foundation. So this is probably what my mom means by me looking like a witch. Yeah, she's secure, so I can literally like, bitch, I can go on a roller coaster and she's still here. So that is why I say, install a band on your wig. It's so fucking important. Yeah, that's basically the hair. This is how I... If you guys are interested in picking up some Julie hair, make sure you guys check the description box below so you guys can go and get yourself some weave. Like I said, I got 10 inches. Also, by the way, like my hair girl, she like put it on a mannequin and she like cut it too. So this isn't like the exact same length. Like this is like a fully customized wig. This is a review video on the hair itself. I wanted to do a very fair review on this hair. So if you guys listened in the first clip, I said that my birthday was in 15 days. It is now November 28th, I believe. I've had this hair for about a month now, so I wanted to really like play with it a bunch and really, because every time I do hair reviews, I feel like I, I mean, I have experience with the hair because I, I promise you guys, I will not put some bootleg hair company on here. I will not promote something that's bootleg. I wanted to actually like play with the hair a little bit, see how it did with like, shedding and stuff, tangling, any of that. I also take really good care of my wigs. I keep them, like I said, on mannequin heads and stuff. This one, the last time I wore her, she just got laid down. But I always have my wigs on mannequin heads because I just don't want it to get tangled. You have to take care of your hair for it to last as well. You can't blame it on the hair company all the time because if you're treating it like shit, then your hair is not going to last. So I've had this hair for pretty much a month now and I have zero complaints, you guys. Like zero complaints. The hair, as you can see, I flat iron it every single time I wear it, which I mean, maybe that's not safe. I don't use any heat protecting spray. Literally, I just flat iron it on like medium setting. And this hair, stiff wear, which look how good this hair is. If you don't believe me on the date, is there a way I could prove it? Yes, with my phone. It is Wednesday. The 28th, can you guys even see that? It is Wednesday the 28th of November. So yeah, I have had this hair for a while and I absolutely love it. There are probably only like four vendors of hair that I personally purchased from and I will ever work with. And I mean, if you watch my channel, you'll see the pattern of like me shopping with the same hair companies over and over. Because I don't want y'all to get scammed. There's so many hair vendors that will send you the most bootleg weave. And I promise you guys, I have ordered from every company that I have ever promoted just because they will send influencers such nice hair. And this is like for real. They will send us such nice hair. And then when you order it, you're like, 
like when you buy it with your own money they don't realize it's you so they send you some bootleg thin hair so don't worry i'm not gonna have y'all get scammed or anything like don't worry about it so yeah that's it for this video i have singing lessons so i'm going to go and that's what i love about this wig it's so fast to throw on and off if you guys are interested in julie hair all the information will be below for you guys and that's it i love you guys and i will see you in another video bye if you guys didn't know, I have a limited edition collection with Velvet Caviar. I have two phone cases and a key ring. So if you guys are interested in that, like I said, it is limited collection, a limited edition. Go check out the description. I have a link to the website. Inside,